Hey Lego fans and welcome back to MB Bricks. It's Maya back with a new Harry Potter mock today as seen from the third book slash movie which I've named Buckbeak's Rescue. If you like this build be sure to give it a like and a comment below and also make sure to hit that subscribe button if you haven't already as well as the bell icon to be notified when new videos are uploaded on Fridays. This was a fun little build to make so without further ado let's dive right in. Buckbeak is a hippogriff, which is a creature that is part winged griffin and part horse that is also a very proud animal. Unfortunately for Buckbeak, he has fallen victim to Draco and Lucius Malfoy, who claimed he was too dangerous to be kept alive and therefore was sentenced to be executed. Harry and Hermione wanted to help Buckbeak for Hagrid, who was his owner. To do this, they had to be very sneaky, of course, as they had to let the Minister for Magic and the Executioner see Buckbeak before they arrived at Hagrid's, otherwise they would think Hagrid set him free. Cue the scene. Harry and Hermione are hiding behind a large pile of pumpkins waiting for the perfect moment to rescue Buckbeak. The pumpkin patch is completed with lots of vines and a scarecrow in the back with a rickety stone fence around the exterior. Behind the duo, the grass leads out to the forest, so I've added a few trees using dark green leaves and olive green stock pieces to add volume. Buckbeak is resting comfortably in the pumpkin patch, unaware of the impending doom. As Harry would eventually approach and try to coerce him away to hiding, he would refuse to leave Hagrid's yard. Hermione would step in to bait him with some dead animals to eat, and I have represented this with a couple of hanging skunk animal pieces. Overall, this was a fun little build with one of my favorite color schemes. I hope you've enjoyed this build today, and if you would like to see more Harry Potter mocks on this channel, I will leave a link in the description to a playlist of all those kinds of builds. Again, please do subscribe to support this channel if you haven't already, as it helps me out a lot. Thanks again for checking out this video today, and until next time, keep on building!